Okay, dear students, let us see what is there in this question. P and Q are two opposite point charges. The force F acts on P due to Q. That is attractive force because both of the charges are of opposite sign. The electric field strength E at P are shown. So the electric field is also shown. Which diagram shows the force on Q due to P and the electric field strength at Q? Okay, fine. Now, um, first of all, let us say these two charges are of opposite sign. Now, I'm, I'm making my own diagram now. It's a little bit confusing. Uh, this diagram that I am making will be more clearer. This is P and this is Q. And both of them are having opposite charges. So we don't know which charge is positive and we don't know which charge is negative. But we know that they are of opposite sign. If they are of opposite sign, there will be attractive force. So P is having a force which is in this direction. Obviously, Q will also be having force in this direction. So I can say that this is the force on P because of Q and this is force on Q because of P. Both of the forces make action reaction pair according to the Newton's third law also. So they are equal as well as opposite to each other. And both of them are Coulombic forces. Now, moving next. Now they are talking about the electric field strength. So if we are talking about a uniform electric field, it means that the electric field will not change either the magnitude or the direction. So both of the things will be same as it, they are on P, the same will be on Q. So I can say that there is an electric field here and the direction of electric field is like this. And it is a uniform electric field that I am trying to show. So uniform electric field is shown by using parallel lines. Uh, which are equidistant. So if you are having that kind of uh, a graph here, that only means that it is a uniform electric field. So the value of E is same at all the points in the space. So at Q, the electric field is this. It is also in this direction and it is also, and this is also in the left direction. So I can say that for Q, the electric field will look like this and the force on Q because of P that will also be in this direction so when now we are checking our options here so b is the only such option in which e and f are in the same direction that is towards left so this is how we do this question so my dear students this is professor varun please do not forget to subscribe to the youtube channel and share the youtube channel with all your friends all the best bye